Hi folks, welcome back. Hope you are doing well. Today we have a lecture 7 of ICT A to Z beginner series. Today lecture we are going to learn about, understand about order block, breaker block and mitigation block. Okay. So make sure if you are new to our channel, make sure you subscribe our channel and watch these previous six lectures so you did not confuse on this lecture. Let's jump into the video. The order block is an area where you take entry for a long and short the smart money reversal okay your POI or whatever you call the area where you buy and sell and the probability of your trades okay to be a valid order block should be price tap on some sort of POI it can be a spot resistance higher time frame or whatever you call okay once it does that the price reverse and come back to that previous up close candle that make higher low to higher high in that area that order flow where you will find this order block to be a valid order block also you will see a fair value gap if there was a no fair value gap that is not a high probability order block okay I, I will show you some example on this video as well the breaker block is an area where you see higher high higher low higher high the price tap on some sort of poi then is down shift the market to from bullish to bearish okay and close to the close downside the previous higher low to higher high this up close kind of series and close below with displacement and wins price retest to that first candle the first up close candle and retest that area and reverse from there it's called a breaker block okay to be uh, what is the mitigation block mitigation block and breaker block look like a same but the characteristic of mitigation block is that in breaker block you see a higher high higher low higher high but in mitigation block you see a higher high higher low higher high higher low then fail to make a new higher high fail to make a new swing high okay then it's break down to the recent higher higher low then it's retest again on this first up close candle that's called a mitigation mitigation block to be all valid or to be you want to valid if you want valid order block breaker block mitigation block to trade tra entry on it must be price tap on some sort of higher time frame py for example i will show you example here this is let's consider this is a red candle and here is a green candle okay okay so you consider this as an order block let's say okay this is should be a daily time frame four hour okay once the price tap on your lower time frame okay once price tap on this area you will shift to your time frame into the lower time frame okay and you will have to find these type of scenario if you see this type of scenario then you should take entry on your money you're doing by money management and a risk management okay so in order block and mitigation block they have three point of interest okay so for example in the bullish scenario we have this red candle then we have a green candle right okay we only mark out the red candle okay the bearish candle vice versa for the bearish uh, order block okay we have three point of this order block upside downside and the center point the center point we call is the consequent uh, uh, approachment of this level okay the mid level of this outer block is called consequent level okay many time price you see if come the first level is here where you can take entry the second level and the last level okay from below if price go downside the setup was become invalid okay let me show you some example 
so you will understand as you see in here we are in a gold one hour time frame <coughs> price tap on some sort of poi in a kill zone hours see what i saw what i tell kill zone hour. what is the time 10 am new york time once does that okay also another thing price take out the liquidity of the previous one it does not close downside with a displacement candle like that then price react upside and close above it right okay one does is that you will going to find this theory type of setup first one is order block the order block is the last candle right okay the last candle and should we have a fair value gap okay so we have a fair value gap here in the uh, in the next lecture you will uh, going to understand the fair value gap inversion fair value gap bear with me and don't miss out okay so also one thing i want you for your notes that order block is not only a last candle no remember that this is a most important point the people does not know smc ict the people who is not listen properly to the inner circle trader they miss the main point the last candle is not only the order block this whole series of down close candle is called order block many smc people say this is the order flow okay they are right on some some of their points but these all candles are order block okay not only one candle is order block remember that okay so to validate this order block it should be tap on some type of sort uh, sort of poi right okay after that price also give you a fair value gap this will validate this order block okay for example you are not a order block trader so what you do you will wait for a breaker block so where we have a breaker block i will tell i told you once price break upside to the previous lower low or lower high okay as uh, vice versa on your bullish or bearish bias okay you will see the last up close candle okay price will retest that one and you will see a reaction to the upside okay uh, in the coming videos when you see these some examples you will going to understand what i'm talking about okay so don't worry about these things okay now i uh, let me show you some mitigation block example so to mitigation block i told you that price will make higher high higher low higher high then price make higher higher low higher low and then want to should make a higher high but it doesn't it fail right it fail to make a new swing high or you can say higher high then price break to the downside close below here so now what we do we will mark this down close candle the last okay and you will see that price just retest and give you a reaction retest and give you a, a reaction okay so in coming videos when i uh, share you some examples of these all things aligned with the fair value gap uh, inversion fair value gap so you will going to understand these all thing okay i hope you understand something here in this video and you learn something here uh, make sure you subscribe our youtube channel and join our telegram channel the both link in the description in the below and uh, if you join us some good breaker with zero spread zero commission and uh swap free with a good leverage the link will be in the description okay until next time be safe